Hello, and welcome to Cooking Lessons for Dad. My name is Karen Brayer, and today I'm going to make the easiest rice recipe ever. We're gonna cook brown rice in our toaster oven. It is so easy, and you don't even need to heat up your whole kitchen with your oven. The ingredients in this recipe are long grain brown rice, salt, and I prefer kosher, and then we have boiling water that I am boiling in an electric kettle. So you don't even need a kitchen for this recipe. The first thing that I'm gonna do is in a one quart to one and a half quart casserole dish, make sure it's one that fits in your toaster oven and that you can close the door with. So I have my dish, we have three quarters cups of long grain brown rice one quarter to one half teaspoon of salt. And like I said, I like kosher salt. I'm gonna put just a little shy of a half teaspoon. You can go light on the salt now and add more when you're finished. So I heated my water in an electric kettle. I need one and one half cups. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and stir that in. We got one cup. Another half cup and go ahead and stir it just to make sure the salt is distributed evenly. Okay, next we're gonna cover it. Okay, I preheated my oven to 375 degrees. I'm gonna cover the dish with foil, making it airtight as much as possible so the steam will stay inside. And you wanna make sure and put the shelf on the lowest level. And you can see, we'll go ahead and put this in. So we're gonna bake this 45 minutes or until the rice is tender and the liquid is absorbed. So we'll check it in 45 minutes. If it's not quite done, we can add a few more minutes. Okay, so we'll see you in 45 minutes. Okay, so the timer went off on the toaster oven and it turned off. It was a few minutes ago. That's a good thing about toaster ovens is if you're not there, it'll just turn right off. Let's check it. And it is perfectly done. We want to fluff it up with a fork. Let me see if you can see this. Okay, you can see how delicious this looks. It's nice and moist, completely cooked. Let's go try it. So you can add more salt right now if you would like. This makes three three-quarter cup servings. Maybe it says three servings, but it's probably like, in our house, that's probably two. All right, I'll just add a little more salt. And there you go. Perfectly cooked brown rice, and it was so easy. You don't even need a kitchen. If you have a toaster oven, you just need to be able to boil some water. And I just use my hot water kettle. If you're in a dorm, you could make this anywhere. You could make it wherever you have a toaster oven. Well, let's try this. Mmm, perfectly cooked. Try it this week, let me know how it turns out, and have a great day.